Hello, sir. Yes, yes. Sir, it is showing an attribute error that library manager dot views has no attribute books. Mm, views in views you are getting error. Yes, sir. I, I am also facing the similar problem, but the error is a bit different. Python was not found. A uh, pipe. Okay. Uh, uh, okay. So see, uh, in views, uh, can you check uh, whether there is no typo somewhere? Mm. This is the line. In views file. Yeah, in views first. Uh, render HTTP import HTTP response. Create your views here. Define books request. Return HTTP response books one map to Python. It is correct, sir. At my end, it yes, goes sir. okay. All right. Uh, okay, I think I. So I think there are two different problems here. I think Dr. Kulkarni has a problem with Python. So, for Python, if you remember, uh, like we did yesterday, you have to open Anaconda with a run as administrator, then go to the environments tab. Then click on the arrow, click on open terminal, and in that terminal you have to run the python manage.py uh, command. Yeah, yesterday after, also I had the same problem. Yeah. After going to the uh, correct folder, which is Django project on your desktop, so you'll have to first do those steps. Open your terminal, go to the correct folder, then go to the folder containing manage.py, and then run the python manage.py command so the command will not run in any terminal by default please follow the steps like we followed yesterday open anaconda with the run as administrator option go to environment tab go to the base root you will see an arrow click on the arrow click on open terminal in open terminal after you have opened the terminal use your cd command please Find the path of the folder where manage.py is located, which is somewhere on your desktop in a Django project folder. Once that is done, go to that particular folder using the cd command in your terminal. Once you are there, only then this command will work. Hello, sir. Yes. Uh, sir, I did the exact same thing, but it is still showing the same error that it has no attribute books. Correct. Then you have not done the exact same thing because it would have worked otherwise. Can you please uh, share your screen or paste uh, the code? Uh, it will show you the file name also, so you can you can just find that piece of code in that proper file and paste it here. Sir, will you please open the uh, link where our server is running, like in localhost port 8000? Okay, possible that you are also getting the same. Open it. No, but that error would have shown up while running the server only. I uh, not found this. You do books, no? Is this same error is showing? Yeah, we have, we have not reached that point. Okay, this is the attribute error. No, somebody got an attribute error, no? Yes, sir. So let me show uh, share my screen. Uh, Pratham, if you like to stop sharing, if that. Okay. Sir, I have a different problem. Mm, I execute. Right. I executed that command in the terminal. Uh, it went to the performing system checks. Now Correct. it has no issue, but uh, one thing it has uh, suggested you have 18 unapplied migrations. Yes, you can ignore that. That's fine. Hello, sir. Okay. Yes. So, so the server is started. Correct. Uh, the module library manager manager dot views has no attribute books. Can you open the books? Where you define books? Yes, sir. So this is the views.py file. And uh, index you have written. In your views, you have right. written index. So in views, you've taken half of the information from the, the, the GitHub repository and half from Prathamesh. Prathamesh has defined the function in the views.py as books. So you will have to define also as books. Or you can change it to index there. One thing has to change, either the function name or the reference in the URL.py. Any one will have to change. For now, just okay. keep it as book. That will work. Thank you, sir. Anyway, anyone else having similar issues or some error while running the server? If the server ran 
then please wait uh, there could be something that shows up that is fine yeah so uh, what does it say the url yeah. is not there. okay can you open yeah, your right. url in your qi in your spider editor or whichever editor books slash can you uh, can you remove the slash at the end so you added one slash but you have not added the slash in your url in your browser not the, uh, the first one the first one okay. slash books the leading one uh, at the start of this one because it's already added by previous view the root url and did you save it Okay, when I am facing a problem, yeah, can you share the screen quickly, Anushree? Yeah, yeah, just hold on. Yeah. Uh, manager, M small. Uh, okay. See, uh, yeah, okay, that is one thing. Uh, with this URL, when I'm like using, I'm getting an error here that books views dot books. Is there some problem? Like, actually, I got disconnected for a few minutes in between. Can you open yeah, yeah, yeah. You need to import uh, uh, the views because this file should know now which views you are talking about. So you need to import. Uh, yeah, from your app, uh, you need to import the views. So maybe I'll uh, show you my URLs. Uh, yeah, and do save uh, settings.py. Okay, in settings.py, do I have to make any changes? No, only here, no, no. right? You yeah. just made one, right? So this yeah, only that. this. I did. Uh, yeah, into the apps, I added library manager. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, Abhi now. Uh, yes, sir. Yeah, you sure. can show your screen. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we we have to come to that point. Yeah, you have to give slash books because now you have created. A new URL, so it says uh, there is no match. So slash books, if you give it, will it will run? Sir, slash books uh, in in the you uh, are yeah in the address set. No, not there in the browser. Sir, in the browser. Eight thousand. Or... Yeah, I'll, I'll show this. I'll show this. Uh, oh. I'll be coming here. Yeah, I think everyone uh, reached this point where the server is running. Once uh, the server is running, uh, you have to go to your web browser where you will be requesting for the resources. So, okay, once you go there, type this localhost a colon 8000 slash books. Sir, yeah, yeah. After, uh, after I open administrator, what are the comments that we have to do? Yesterday uh, I have completed that. Sir. I got the I opened I copy and paste in the web browser. It got congratulations. Mm -hmm. Yesterday completed, but again I want to do. No. Yeah, yeah. So now you have followed. Uh, you have created the views, URLs, everything. Yes, sir. Completed. Yeah, yeah. Now you localhost colon eight thousand sleds books. Okay. Now basically we are overriding the uh, books uh, that yesterday what you saw. Okay, so you will have to give localhost colon 8000 slash books. Okay, sir. Okay. Yeah, yeah. We can get that okay URL back. That is not a, that is the root uh, URL. That is fine. But for now, uh, understanding purpose, we are creating a new one. We are overriding it. Hmm. So if you put localhost colon 8000 slash books, books is the URL that we have mentioned. It will automatically call the view that we have created. Facing some problem when I put it in the browser. Okay. I'm not getting this. Uh, I'm uh, getting the page not found. Yeah, yeah. The URL is uh, the address is localhost colon eight thousand slash books. Correct. Yeah. Okay. Still. Uh, yeah. Can you share your screen? Yeah, I'm sharing. Yeah. Yeah. I think uh, in URLs you have not added. It shows that there is no config for books so it's yeah. missing the urls yeah you need to add. i need i need to add yeah. the url yeah otherwise it will not recognize in view file no, in urls okay in url file sorry mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah uh which url i need to add sir 
books okay uh, so here it's showing yeah uh, yeah yeah do not uh, do not write that request client fb uh, because it may throw an error because this file will execute no and so first line is okay sir the url patterns or shall i remove it remove it yeah you yeah. can put it in comment actually but fine you can remove it yeah, yeah. but uh, i think you have uh, nahi nahi you have uh, created this url somewhere else i guess hmm. no this is the url file uh okay uh yeah can you close it yeah uh, no sir you... sir there there is a semicolon is there in url the path is defined is there book after that they are mentioned in a semicolon no just a minute i am opening it yeah 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 once again i'll check it uh so this is yeah you it should you should Have that line. You are in a you are in a different like that URL is somewhere different, and or it got created or something, and this is different. Uh, if you have Spider ID, it will be easier to track the file so that you don't edit something in a different place. No, no, I have saved it somewhere else. I think. Correct. Which is yeah. why the Spider ID is better because you will just edit it there, save yeah, it there. Yeah, this this file I have. Data. This file I have. Which I need correct. to use this one or the previous one, which is uh, there. The previous one is the correct one. You created this on your own, and it got saved here at manage.py level, which is the yeah, wrong yeah. place for the file. Yeah, yeah. So delete this file from here okay. and go back to that other file. Add the uh, use the use uh, the line the code line that you need to add here, na? Yeah. This one I need to change. Mm -hmm. yes. Now is it okay? No, no, no. You have to import uh, views. Now you have to also think. import. Uh, it is imported now. Don't need no, views. Your books, books view is in library manager. So from from library manager, import views. Okay, one more command is required. Yes. Okay, from Space. library manager, your app name. Library import. manager, import yeah, views. Okay. Yeah. So now this views is refers to your created view in your application, and yeah. from that it will call the books. Yeah. Now that the uh, URL will work. Yeah, it should work. No, still it is not working. Can you show the uh, server uh, where the server is? Yeah, running? I'm showing. This is the server status. Yeah, go of, down at the bottom. Bottom. You have to add a library manager to your settings. It will then recognize. Uh, have you added uh, settings in settings dot py? Uh, Just a minute. I I think I have yeah. not added. I need to check. Ah, huh, this one. Where it is to be added? Installed apps. Ah. Huh. Yeah. Installed apps. Yeah, last one, na. Yeah. What I need to add here? Uh, the app name, so the project will recognize it. Yeah. Library underscore manager. Library underscore manager. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Good. And yeah. yeah. This is done. Mm -hmm. Now, now the me. now check the server. Yeah. Import error. No, no. Uh, get out of this. Like uh, pressing some Control C or something. Get. Uh, we'll restart the server and check once. It... I'm in the server window. Yeah, Control C. Can you press Control C? Control C. Yeah. Now again, press up arrow. Hmm. Yeah. Enter. We are re-running re the server. Plum library manager import views. Mm. Okay. Uh, can you show your views? Where are where is the views located? Yeah. Library manager. Hmm. Views is here. Mm, it's here. Okay. It's in proper place. Uh -huh. um, mm -hmm. I think so. He doesn't have the underscore underscore in it. Fine. One second. Let me check oh. the structure at my place. 
Yes, 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 correct. So you seem to have done something with the files in that folder. So uh, can you please visit yes, that sir. GitHub link? Which one? And uh, the one I pasted in chat. Yeah, just a minute. Uh, hold on, sir. Yeah. GitHub link. Yeah. So you need all those files. Because you don't have those files, it is not able to recognize the folder correctly. So I think your dunder init dunder py file is missing. Can you just create a new app? I think so. It will be faster, right? If you create a new app. In uh, you know. uh, this are URLs. Anand sir. Yes. Sir, can you please open the URL uh, file, sir? Yeah. Just create a double underscore. I'll type out the name double underscore init double underscore dot py file in this folder in library manager folder and it will work in so library manager no. folder. Correct. Just a minute. You already have it open behind you. You can see the views file. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Windows. Yes, Correct. here I need so to create one more. You have to create one more with the specific name that I've sent you, which is underscore underscore init underscore underscore dot py. Just a minute, sir. Yeah, init py, na? Yeah, underscore underscore init. Hmm. Double underscore, right? Double. So there are two yeah, underscore yeah, in the beginning, it. two in the end, dot py. Save it and uh, run your server again. But it is a blank file, na? It is blank file, nothing inside. Okay. I will go for the server again. Control C. Sir, double underscore. Uh, this double underscore. Okay. No, sir. Still, the problem is there. Ah, right. Okay. Can you? Okay. Just do one thing. Uh, open your Windows Explorer, which is at, at the back. Yeah. Huh. Right. Go to Library Management. Not huh. the, that one. The bottom one. Ah. Huh. Uh, just rename the library manager to something else. Just call it one, two, three. Just add one, two, three at the end. Library manager folder. Just rename it. Okay, just a minute. Go to library management, the top level folder, and then right click there. Okay. Ah. Just call it one, two, three. Some yeah. add some random number. Correct. Okay. Uh, something is open. Now, Please close all your work of notepad. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. I, have, I have closed. I have closed. Yeah. Now rename this. Enter. Still, still something is open. Uh, you have another Windows Explorer window open. Can you close that? Yeah. Yeah. Close all of those except for the one that you are using. Yeah. Thank you. Now go back to. Uh, yeah. Now rename this. What is left now? Okay. Only single is there. In it, all those files are closed. Sir, it is spider ID. But spider ID is not part of it. Just close this also then. Uh, hmm, now it is done. Thank you. Uh, now go to your command line, close the server, control C for the server so that yeah. the server is closed. Right? Uh, Python manage, no, close the server. I don't want the server. Close it. Control C is enough. Hmm. Right? Just a minute. Now, wait, wait, wait. Huh. Okay. Now up arrow. Uh, remove the run server and say start app library underscore manager no no 
only remove the run server word and add start okay. app space library underscore manager. Can this now? Yes. Okay. Ah, okay, correct. Uh, go in your settings dot py file, open it in your uh, Windows yes, folder. Sir. Yeah, go to the library management folder. Uh, go to settings. settings. Uh, just add. Go down to install apps option. Yeah. Yeah. Just add. Uh, just add a hash key in front of the library manager line. Hash key. So, hash. Yes. Hash. Okay, just a minute, hold on. Yeah, huh. Now save this. Space is required. Uh, just save, just hit save. That's it, nothing else to change. Just save as is. Mm -hmm. Correct. Now go back to your uh, server. Thing. Server, run the command again. Up arrow to run the same command again. Unknown command. Unknown command. Uh, yeah, you should add start app then library underscore manager so same command python manage dot py start app space library start app yes just yes, start app hmm. press enter right now uh, if you go back to your folder you can open spider or whatever you want go back to your folder in settings, remove the hash key that we added. Yeah. Why it was required? Uh, I'll tell you why it was required. Uh, basically, what has happened is uh, your library manager folder did not have the re relevant file. Okay. So your app was not being recognized. Mm -hmm. So what we did was we created the new app with the same name. Uh, you can delete that library manager to folder if you want to, but you'll have to copy paste all those things, right? So you'll have to I will make, keep it. make sure you make sure that URL is correct. Make sure that your views.py is correctly edited. Yes. And that's it. And you should not be touching the other files. Yes. Uh, and should work. So can Srinidhi or someone else please share their screen right now? Shall I stop my screen, sir? Yes, you can. It should be stopped by now. Uh, it's okay, sir. I got mine sorted. Yours is sorted out. Cool. Uh, Abhijit has a problem with page not found 404. So probably he is not adding books at the end or something of that sort. Yes, I have to check it. Correct. Okay, Abhijit, can you share your screen, please? No, show me your server. You're not running your terminal. You're not running the server only. So how will you see anything in your browser? Your run server should always be running. If you want to see anything in the browser, your run server command should be active and running. So press up arrow, press enter, it will start running again, and then you should be able to see something in your browser. Right? Uh, that should solve the problem. Refresh your browser. Okay. So you have your URL started with a capital B. Uh, we specifically told you to please follow the instructions ditto uh, any changes means that you will sort of encounter something like this so you can add a capital b in your in your browser only and you will see the same thing that everyone else is seeing uh, now for now you don't need to change anything if you want to change you can change it later in the url.py file okay sir in my case if i try to run this site can't be reached uh, appearing uh, are you Wonderful. running the server properly yeah, yeah, yeah. The uh, server is okay now. Uh, uh, I need to run the server. Yeah. Thank you. Yes. Um, no. Avinash. Uh, cool. So you can share your screen for now, and we'll try to see what is Sir, happening. Sir, I'm facing uh, the same problem now. Still. Which problem? Uh, which... Sir, that URL is in. So what you can do is on your server, there should be something that shows up as an error on the bottom. Just the last few lines of your server output. Can you please copy paste it in the chat? 
Mr. Kulkarni, can you please share your screen and we can try to figure out what is going wrong. Right. So what is the error? Uh, can you scroll down to what your server is showing at the very end? Module Django Contrib has no attribute URL. Admin .url. That is uh, admin dot URLs. I think is wrongly written. Yes, sir. Yeah. So it should be. Why open the URL files? Sir. Okay, I'm opening it. Yeah. Yeah. So here the the bug. If it admin. is admin dot, uh, that is right. the full stop is there. You have to enter a comma. Here, no pass. Ah. Here, comma is required. Yes, okay. sir. Yeah. I think you, you have to save it, sir. You have to save that file. Yeah, most probably it was not saved last time. Yeah. Yeah. Right now you have to refresh that page, sir. I think that will be work. That should be admin dot site dot urls. It will still throw an error. Admin, uh, go to URLs. py. Yeah. Yeah. Admin dot site. So, admin dot. Uh, admin dot URLs. Now you change it. It's written admin. already. No, no, no. Uh, admin dot site. S I T E site. Not URLs. Before URLs. Before URLs. Acha. S I T. Dot. Dot. Okay. Yeah, save it. Now something else has no attribute. Uh, books. Have you uh, written books in your views? I think. Yeah, yeah, I have written. I, I remember. No, no, no. In library manager. No, there are no views. In this. No, that is library mm. manager two. No, uh, mm. you are supposed to use the original library manager, right? So this file should be there only. This file should be there only. Okay. This is now junk. This is not required actually. You can delete this folder if you want to. Like I said last time, you need to copy what was in this views, add yeah. it to that that views. Just a minute. Oh, that it will work. Just a minute, hold on. Where I need to create new file now? You don't need to create a new file. There is a library manager also now, right? You have a library manager app. Hmm. Correct. Go there. Go to the view. Open the views file. Yeah. And paste it's everything BA. here. Yeah. And save it. And that has to be deleted. You can delete that. If you don't delete it right now, also it is fine. Uh, I will but, delete uh, again. It will create the confusion. Yeah. It is deleted. Now it is showing a different thing. Cannot import. The spelling is wrong. Response. Just a minute. Huh? Acha, yes. Yeah. Hmm, now the server is working. Thank you. Yeah. Should I share it, sir? Sir, now. Yes, sir. Please, please, sir. Right. Correct. So, what did we say? Was the last instruction was type in books, and you will magically find everything working fine. Type in books in your browser. No, run your server. Your server should be running. That is the correct command. That is fine. Keep that running. You type in slash books, and everything runs fine. Yeah, I think anyone uh, else with issues. It's working at my end, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. yeah sir, I have a problem. Oh. Yeah, yes, you. sir. Can you please quickly share your screen, and we'll try to sort it out for you. It should be manage dot py, not manager. Correct. Who 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 answered that question? Uh, Sasang. Yeah, five points to you, Sasang. So what is the Thank problem? You, there is no manager dot py. There is something called manage dot py in this current folder, right? And there is 
not even manage.py you have to first go into library management then you will find a manage.py file then you can run a command called python manage.py run server and not manager.py run server i think we have already run this command for what four or five times now so uh, this is something that is useful to remember that it is manage.py not manager.py uh, no capital letters allowed no spelling mistakes allowed because the computer doesn't understand uh, and check it for you right so yahan pe grammarly nahi chalta sorry go inside library management folder cd space cd space library management and then run python manage.py run server i'll stop your sharing for now because uh, i don't think i need to specifically instruct and wait for you to solve but uh, you can just go inside that folder and then run python manage.py run server and it should run properly uh, there could be other issues and you can point it out in the chat and we'll try to solve it parallelly uh, but okay, i guess sir. now prathamesh can go ahead with his screen share okay yeah Alright. Uh, thank you, Ankit. Uh, so, yeah. So I think uh, almost all got the output uh, necessary. 